iOS 18 is here. Apple just made the iPhone more powerful and customizable than ever. But that's not all. There's more AI magic coming in. The iOS 18.1 update. Released on September 16th, 2024, iOS 18 is packed with new features that'll change how you use your iPhone. Whether it's home screen flexibility, revamped apps, or messaging upgrades, Apple's newest update has something for everyone. Let's dive in. Home screen customization. First up, home screen customization has never been this flexible. You can now place app icons and widgets anywhere you want, including along the bottom or sides. Want larger icons? You got it. Plus, dark icons and color tinting are here to give your home screen a personal touch. Photos app redesign. The Photos app got its biggest makeover ever. Everything is now in one simplified view, with collections automatically organized by helpful topics. Browsing your photos is faster and more intuitive than ever before. Messaging enhancements. Messaging just leveled up. iOS 18 brings RCS messaging support, making communication with Android users smoother. You can also schedule messages, add fun text effects, and even use new formatting options in iMessage. Control Center. Redesign. Control Center has been completely revamped. You can now group controls, customize layouts, and even integrate third-party app controls, giving you faster access to everything you need. Upcoming iOS 18.1 AI features. But wait, the real game changer is yet to come in the upcoming iOS 18.1 update. Apple Intelligence will introduce AI-powered tools exclusively on iPhone 15 Pro and Pro Max models. Imagine a more conversational Siri, AI-generated images called Genmojis, and even writing tools that help you craft the perfect message. Plus, get ready for text rewriting, image generation through Image Playground, and more. It's the future of mobile intelligence, right in your pocket. What feature are you most excited about? Let us know in the comments, and don't forget to like and subscribe for more updates on the latest tech.